Hello! Welcome back to another episode of Let's Build a City with me, Leader of the Monkeys, and... Patricia, Community Manager for City Skylines. Um, it's been two weeks since the last stream. Patricia's yes. been building by herself. It looks very good. Uh, I'm very <laughs> if excited. So. If you say so. I'm <laughs> I am so <laughs> impressed by like how much I feel like you've learned already. Yeah, like you're a good teacher. Yeah. <laughs> like don't doubt yourself. You're a great teacher. Yes. I'm very, I'm very hyped about that. Thank you. Um, um, but today we were, we were gonna talk about DLCs after the uh, the vacation break. So we've been talking a lot about green cities. Yeah, and I, I think you guys are already a bit fed up with the vanilla stuff. So yeah, we, we can <laughs> dive into the DLCs. I yes. think it's time. And we do have a, a pretty massive eyesore in the form of a giant poop river. Uh, and it would be nice to clean that up. <laughs> so we might we might spend a lot of time trying to do that. Uh, I actually unlock another tile, so this to grow a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, I managed to avoid any major death waves or other dramas, so I think... Oh, and also we have to sh you have to show off how much money we have. If you oh, just scoot, yes. to the, scoot to the uh, side a little. Okay, I'm going to break and oh, make other, again. Maybe other way? Yeah. No, I can't. Aim yeah. <laughs> no, it's my chair. It's my chair. I can't. It's 3.3 3. 3 we'll million, by the way. I told you I'm great at making money. But yeah, I haven't built a tunnel, which I'm very, very proud of. Mm -hmm. Like. Uh, according to Maddie, it works. It's in the right <laughs> it's, place. It's so it's so in the right spot. It connects the industry with like the, the different part on the other side. It's great. It's the I couldn't <laughs> have asked for a better placement of that. Are we going to start with eco stuff already, or we can play around with some other stuff like policies? I think we haven't took. That's true. We haven't looked at policies for a very very long time. Yeah, I mean, I. I Probably. But maybe we should let's let's uh, replace the uh, the pumps that we have for eco pumps so that we pollute less. And mm. then we can let the time run while we look at the policies. <laughs> so that the uh, poop yeah. will clear up a little. Because if we look downriver, um, mm. it gets bad. It gets like really bad. <laughs> we can't see all the way to the edge of the map, but that's pretty, that's uh, pretty yikes. Yeah, okay. So the best DLC for that is Green Cities, as yeah. the name points out. Um, okay, let's see what we have then. Okay, so what would you recommend to do? Um, if you scroll a little bit more to the right, I, I, it's also like, have we unlocked them? I don't even know if we've unlocked I, them. I, we should have. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that at least that one. Yeah. So we have the small one. Okay. Um, and it just, uh, it's the same. It costs a little bit more, but it pollutes um, a uh, lot I, I don't think we have to worry about money at this point. Like, we're good there. True. <laughs> 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 but just, you know, just mentioning it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we're just deleting those first. Mm -hmm. Should we just replace them the same spot or? Yeah. They should. Um. They should also. They should snap the new ones if we just delete the the, the pump itself and not the pipe. Mm. They should just immediately like snap to that. Oh. Point. Okay. Yes. Okay. But yeah. I'm they should go anyway. Okay. I'm, I'm I'm deleting two. So please remember because yes, <laughs> that, that might be a problem later. Yeah. So you should see where. One and two. Yeah, easy. Well, you can already see the difference. Oh, <laughs> yes. Oh, was <laughs> that? Yes. Oh. oh. Yep. Oh, come on. Like, yeah, we gave you the same thing. They just haven't realized yet. <sighs> <laughs> they just haven't realized. <laughs> oh, yeah, that circle. Floating garbage collector. You can plop him in the river and, and, and he'll, like... Okay. Uh, unpollute the the water, but maybe like a little bit further down where there's um more pollution. Uh, I feel the very corner. I mean, yeah, might as well, honestly. Okay, let's try one here. We'll see what we'll do. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> In the middle. Yeah. We'll have to connect. Uh, no, no electricity needed. I think. I doubt it. I think it takes power from like the waves, but we'll see. We'll find out. <laughs> uh, why? Why are you screaming about? No, <laughs> no. Maybe they um, use up more energy. They might the the eco pumps. Let's see. Oh yeah. Well, There's yeah. positives and negatives to everything. Mm -hmm. And if we have wind power, the wind powers uh, might just be producing less at the moment. Yeah. Should we let it run then and see? Yeah. Could maybe increase the budget. But uh, let's look at policies. Yep. Let them scream. So yeah, we probably can expand the districts as well. Mm -hmm. That's a very useful tool, especially if you want to play around with policies, because you can just do certain policies in a certain district, which is very useful. Hmm. Oh, because we made the zones and we have um, the city policy of water and electricity um, 
saving, the, the saving policies for that, we should see, like, a lot of Yeah, um, they, they got applied to, to all the districts mm -hmm. yeah. automatically. Okay, so, uh, like we mentioned, we just turned on the power usage and water usage for the whole city, mm -hmm. so that helped a little bit. What would be the next thing? Like, what policies you usually set up in your city? I usually set um, more, like, I in the city planning tab, which is now unlocked, mm -hmm. yes, um, I usually enable the encourage biking, uh, which means that we'll have a slight decline in the uh, public um, transport mm -hmm. stats, so they'll take buses less, um, but they'll, they'll bike around and it's really cute. But does it mean that we need to upgrade the roads to have no, more... No, no. Because uh, be okay? there's also another policy that's called allow biking on sidewalks, it's just underneath it, which I'm hiding. It's right behind mm. me, right there. Not there it is. Um, <laughs> ah, yes, okay. So if you enable both of them, then they can just, like, you know, bike wherever they want. Okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure the citizens will appreciate. They will. <laughs> <laughs> I know I would appreciate. I, I love those scooters <laughs> in Sto Stockholm. Like, mm -hmm. I love them. How much money are we... We're only making... We're not making a huge uh, we amount. Actually? I mean, 3,000. That's not, like... It's not the biggest number. And policies do cost a lot. We do have a pretty high amount of buildings because we're doing a lot of low density. Mm. Um, and we do have quite a lot of people. So if we enable something like recycling, it might, it's going to cost a fair, like a pretty, pretty penny. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, well, I mean, we're okay with money now. So as long as yeah. it won't go red, I'm, I'm fine. <laughs> we can probably, we can also go red for a pretty long time without worrying. If we're going for the green cities thing, we might want to re do recycling. Mm, yep. Seems to be part of uh, site reduced garbage accumulation, site reduced tax income. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can we can handle that. Yeah. I will allow that. Maybe we could do park bonus or something that just gives pure happiness. Yes, parks and recreation, that one. So it increases the um the land value around the parks and mm -hmm. the plaza, so it'll level up the buildings faster. Mm -hmm. Um but uh, yeah, the the budget'll go up so they'll cost a little bit more. Okay. Uh, do you want to play around with taxes or? Oh, oh, or does this? It's a too big topic. I think to I, I now. personally, I prefer to use the the sliders in mm -hmm. the budget menu. Okay. But these these are good for like just fast swapping. Mm -hmm. Okay, so so leave them for now. I think yeah, I think we're gonna leave them. Okay. Until offices, you can tax offices pretty harshly, and they won't complain that much. Um in my like personal experience so when we have a lot of office space we can definitely like do tax increase for offices mm -hmm. uh, okay so we just turned on well we had power usage and water usage so mm -hmm. we were saving a bit there uh we turn on recycling because we want to get rid of the poop river <laughs> uh, <laughs> not gonna do much for the river <laughs> itself but green city all the way yeah and we had parks and recreation mm -hmm. to give our parks a little bit like i i placed quite a few parks yeah so yeah and encourage biking because we want more cyclists on the sideways. Yes. That's what people will like. <laughs> so, uh, okay, let's see the names. What are yes. the names? We <laughs> <laughs> Egbert Square. I, I did like Central Yolk, Yolk Park. Oh, oh, no. We're in the red. No, we're not popping one. <laughs> no, you have to wait. We could just disable one of the policies that we enabled. No, okay, get... okay, it's oh, going up. Oh, okay, we're good. We're, we're good. in the green, yeah. <laughs> We could also have a peak on happiness and see, maybe we can even raise taxes 1%. If we raise the taxes mm. on everybody Raising for taxes, I like, I like the idea. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta have that true uh, Sweden gameplay here. I mean, we can probably tax industrial guys mm -hmm. a bit more. Like, they're yeah. way too happy. <laughs> we gotta make them sad. Tax them to nothingness. <laughs> they're, they're way too happy. Tax them into sadness. Okay. Industry we're doing. Oh, they're we could, we could, we had the high density residential, I don't think we touched. So we no, could, we haven't. Let's tax that to 11% as well, so mm -hmm. that it, that all the ind uh, residential has 11%. Okay. Same, yeah, same with that. 11 or 10? Ooh, mm. 11. <laughs> 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 See if they can play. They might. They <laughs> might. They fully might. Uh, but then, yeah, industry, 2%. Ooh. 12? No, 11. 12. 12? Oh. Screw it. Okay, See we'll what, see. See what they say. We'll see. <laughs> wow, we have. I think it was like it worked. The taxes worked. <laughs> yeah, look, look. The taxes worked great. Yes. But now we just have to see if they'll complain about it. Uh, <laughs> they look fine so far. Yeah. Oh, and we're making so much money. <laughs> oh, but look at how clear the river is. Oh, yeah. Three, three like poop shoots versus the one regular one. Oh yes. Such you a difference. Yeah, we can see here. 
that is a huge difference. <laughs> yeah, like this part. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's just a clear divide there. Okay, well, uh, we have this thing here. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah, we're working on it. It is honestly clearing it up, though, because it was, mm -hmm. like, fully brown, like, all the way to that bend there. Uh, where we should put the office area? Mm. Any recommendations on those? You do want them to be accessible by most people. I mean, because the city's going to grow out of needing industrial area and mm -hmm. then they're going to want to move into the office so we would want to have it be sort of accessible from the whole city but that doesn't mean that you have to have like small industrial or office zones all over mm -hmm. we just want it to be like in a good space where there's a lot of public transport and stuff okay so i'd recommend like near-ish the station there is a lot of space there we haven't really developed that yeah, area yet. yeah not really yeah just let it be um yeah there's definitely a lot of space here that we can use mm -hmm. Mm. Okay, is the office area like does it create a lot of noise or? Uh, no, no, no. It it sort of um doesn't create any noise, doesn't create pollution. Um, oh. it's definitely the better option when it comes to if if you care about your map being clean and mm -hmm. not polluted. Okay. By any by anything, the most the most thing that it creates is traffic. <laughs> but that's you know you can handle that. I don't know what I'm doing. <clears throat> Placing some roads, some <laughs> weird, weird patterns. Made no sense. I do. I. I mean, having a complete grid city is fine. It's efficient when it comes to like organization and and having the optimal use of all the, you know, all the tiles. But having some irregularities make the city. Look I mean, I'm pretty sure any professional city planner would have a go at me right now. <laughs> like, <laughs> I. I do. I do like the little herringbone shape that. It happens for me too. I it always I always end up making like this sort of herringbone shape mm. where they like stack like that. Yeah, zone some office. I don't think the demand is super high, so we don't probably need a lot, but that much. Mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Just wanted them to like don't want to place extra electricity wires, so <laughs> Yeah, you wanna have them close. That makes sense. Good strats, good strats. Oh, we should probably pull a bus route down this avenue, huh? Mm-hmm. So maybe the like maybe idea. the bus route that we already have going along the avenue could just extend okay, over here. Let's see. Uh, we have this one, but this one already is the, like the very the pink one. Maybe. Yeah. Where, does it cut into the high density area there? If, uh, you go, if you go down a little bit. Yes, I think so. Oh yeah, we just added like one stop in there, mm -hmm. huh? Yeah. Yeah, we could just keep pulling that down the avenue. I think. I'd actually put it on the avenue. On the avenue. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just right at that intersection right there. You, we, they, they walk they walk quite far if mm -hmm. they have to. Okay. Uh, are we going through this zone, or we should just, just connect it to the uh, train hub, just like sort okay. of next to the stop that's already there, like one segment behind or. Mm, the stop is out here. Okay. Yeah, they're on the edge. Yeah, like right there. That's fine. And then just back. Maybe connect it. See that one stop on the pink line going that way on the avenue. This one? Yeah, just have it stop there too, on the same spot. Oh, that is so packed. <laughs> we probably have to increase the budget a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, but yeah, just connect it there and then uh, finish it. I mm -hmm. wonder where it'll, where it'll go, but... <laughs> oh. Yeah, it'll just do a loop, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> yep. There we go. Oh, okay, okay. Let's, let's see how it's going with the... Uh, it's the yellow one. Mm-hmm. Oh no, we just created the yellow one. Uh, this one's a pink one. Oh, we yeah. have 13 vehicles. Uh, mm. We can add a few more here. Yeah. Do we need to? Yeah. yeah, I'd add some more. You can see on the bar. I mean, I'll look over here so I can see the whole thing. There's one stop that has five, like 460. <laughs> you can actually see it right there. Yep. Maybe we want to probably do what? Yeah, 150 or maybe even more. Okay, let's. But well, let's let's yeah. yeah yeah once yeah let's let's just stop uh, pause there for a second but. The first stop is a little bit worrisome. Can't lie. Oh, we can now see very clearly that yeah. that that worked. Look at how much cleaner the river is already. <laughs> that is pretty bonkers. That worked. Now there's just one stream of poop <laughs> instead of so many more. <laughs> I'll take it. I mean, we have six pumps or six poop shoots, <laughs> and they produce almost no pollution. Okay, no, we're quite good there. Yeah. Oh, quite good there. But yeah, um, again, guys, if there's anything you would like to see now when we enter the DLC zone, yeah, 
so yes, we're definitely going to tackle more traffic stuff from mass mm -hmm. transit specifically yeah. because I'm terrible at it and Mali just does some <laughs> stuff that work. I love I love it. So yeah, I'm glad you like it. <laughs> I really glad. Traffic management, making intersections and figuring out the you know public transport and adding bike paths and yeah, at least one of us. Ah. <sighs> Uh, but yeah, that would be all for this episode. And like I said, uh, we'll come back with more stuff. Yes, next more week. Next week, the <gasps> same time. See you there, I hope. And thanks for joining us today. Yep. Bye. Bye. <laughs>